Make your point on the news hour. Join Arnav every night on the news hour with your question. Ask your question and join the debate. And the Dalal Street had had a lukewarm response to Rajan's decision. Our markets have recovered after a knee-jerk reaction. We also have Ajay who is joining us from ET now at this point in time. Ajay, what's your reading? How really have the markets reacted uh, to that letter coming in from Raghuram Rajan? Okay, I'm not sure if Ajay can hear me at this point in time or not, but what we are given to understand uh, is that there has been a bit of recovery after a knee-jerk reaction that we've seen. We've also seen the dollar actually coming up stronger, the rupee there weakening. And uh, remember, a lot of people, in fact, have been waiting to watch out for what really is going to be the response uh, of the markets when they've opened today. As far as a lot of uh, forex money, the divestment bonds uh, that are concerned uh, on this entire issue. Now, uh, we are given to understand that the markets have seen a bit of recovery now after the earlier response we've seen to Raghuram Rajan's decision when he's made it clear that he's not taking a second term as the RBI governor. And let's not forget that the very crucial referendum uh, is also slated for Thursday, uh, whether Britain is going to stay with the European Union or not. So clearly those are issues which could lead to volatility as far as the markets then are concerned. But yes, the markets have recovered uh, from a knee-jerk reaction that we've seen earlier. We are connecting with Ajay. Okay, I believe Ajay now is with us. Ajay, if you can hear me, what's the reading that you've seen on the day-to-day -day that the markets have opened up after that decision we've seen from Raghuram Rajan? Well, that's correct. This is a very important, uh, you know, decision uh, by the RBI governor and which actually made a lot of traders and investors nervous uh, over the entire weekend. But when we opened for trade this morning, uh, you know, unlike... Uh, contrary belief, the market had only a very short uh, knee-jerk reaction on the downside and within mm -hmm. minutes of opening, that sharp uh, you know, cut downwards was actually bought into. In fact, the Sensex and the Nifty both uh, within minutes of opening in the negative started trading higher and uh, actually Sensex came with gains of almost 100 points. In fact, most of the experts uh, we spoke to, be it uh, veteran investors like uh, Rakesh Junjunwala, Wala Bansali, Manish Chokhani, most uh, did not rule out the good work RBI governor has done uh, you know, in his in, in his stint right now. But at the same time, they thought they uh, most of them believe that this is not going to rock the boat for Indian markets. Mm. Uh, even the rupee had a very small knockdown and then recovered smartly. So it was a very mature kind of a reaction when traders and investors saw that this entire decision was digested by the market smartly. So, you know, Ajay, Ajay, what, what's your larger reading of what is expected? Does this mean that the market actually wants to wait and watch till the new successor is decided? Because that is also something crucial now. You're absolutely right. And the seven names which are doing the rounds, uh, you know, they are extremely respectable name in the entire financial market community. So no less the, the successor is also likely to be in any form to the uh, you know, current governor. Apart from that, there's also uh, a lot, lot of other global things which, which really cushioned the market fall this morning is the referendum on 23rd. The remain vote is actually gaining uh, you know, uh, uh, almost 30%, just 30% believe that there are chances of Britain exiting the European Union. So global mm. queues are extremely positive. The new names which are doing the round are also no less uh, pretty eminent personalities. So all these positives are actually outweighing the nervousness which actually was caused because of the news coming in that RBI governor will not continue. So that is why the reaction was very measured uh, when we opened for trade this morning.